commuters countrywide are stranded this morning due to a nationwide bus driver strike. Bus drivers from different trade unions are demanding a 15% wage increase, while the employer is offering 9%. Companies affected include Patco, Golden Arrow, Rear Via, Autopax and Greyhound. Some commuters have expressed frustration, saying the strike by bus operators is taking a toll on their pockets. Long queues have formed at the taxi ranks in Soweto as it's the largest taxi rank in that township. This is due to commuters who normally rely on buses as their main form of transport, now using taxis to get to work. Not even a single bus operating locally has been spotted in the township, however long distance buses seem to be operating as normal. It also felt the first effects of the bus strike as they tried to make their way to work. Commuters who normally use buses were forced to make alternative arrangements. This has cost them more money. Taxi operators were smiling with many people forced to make use of their services. The metro is also home to a number of motor manufacturers and many staff from these companies rely on bus transportation. And also in uh, Polokwane, it's business as usual, as well as in ad adjacent townships, as thousands of commuters who travel every day from Sashejo, Mankweng and Molochi to Polokwane used Madodi and Bawaduba bus services to travel to various destinations. However, they are being forced to pay fees from their pockets as they've already purchased their monthly bus tickets. The national bus driver strike is expected to affect the annual Zion Christian Church trips to Maria. Yeah.